hey what's up guys welcome back to the channel so today we are going to see how to write a uh, factorial program using python uh, using for loop. first uh, let me take input from the user yeah, let me first initialize a variable and take input from the user so input enter the number okay if you just leave it like this the input will be in the string so we need to typecast it so we need to convert this uh, string input into integer input so for that uh, we'll just put int func uh, we'll just put this input function inside int okay now that we have taken input from the user uh, let's uh, first initialize a variable of factorial uh, fact fact equals 1 okay so now we need to put a for loop for i in range of 1 comma num plus 1 so here you need to understand uh, if uh, in range function if you don't give any start value it will automatically take it as 0 so we don't want that at the end if you multiplied uh, multiply anything by 0 the answer will be 0 so we don't want to we don't want that so initially we will give start value as 1 and end is num plus 1 if the user enters uh, uh, if the user enters num equal to 4 it's gonna it's gonna go till 3 that's why we need to add 1 to it so if the user enters 4 uh, this range function will take input from 1 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4 if uh, it has num plus 1 if the uh, it doesn't have num plus one it will just go till three so uh, we need to put num plus one okay so now that we have uh, a range function uh, now let's uh, put a condition if num is equal to zero uh, zero here double equal to uh, double equal to indicates it's equals uh, equals to if single equal to means that's assignment operator uh, please uh, note that okay so if num equals equals 0 we need to print 1 we need to print 1 so uh, that is 0 factorial is always 1 and then now else condition else we need to fact equals fact multiplied by i multiplied by i okay and then we need to print factorial we need to print factorial uh, let's make it more uh, nicer uh, we'll put uh, uh, this formatted string facto factorial of factorial of num is comma fact let me put same over here as well copy paste I just put one okay so coding part is over uh, now let's just uh, execute this program I'm gonna enter 1 factorial of 0 is 1 and now let's key 5 it should the output, output should be 120 the factorial of 5 is 120 so here uh, if I give input as uh, num, num equal to uh, let me just put over here uh, hash num equal to 5 uh, then range function will go from 1 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4 comma 5 because I have given num plus 1 if it was num then uh, range would have been till 4 1 2 3 4 so we need to include last uh, this 5 as well that's why we need to put num plus 1 so here a num is not equal to 0 so this condition is not satisfied it will go to the else part so else here uh, it's going to it's going to multiply all the numbers 
so the initial value is 1 1 1 into 1 now fact is 1 and then at the next uh, condition uh, it's gonna again multiply by 2 and now factorial is 2 it, it's uh, fact is 2 fact value is 2 and uh, next 3 and next multiplied multiplied by 3 then again multiplied by 4 then again multiplied by 5 so we'll get it let me just uh, execute uh, let me just try one more value I'm gonna give factorial as 4 there you go 4 3 is a 12 12 2 is a 24 so factorial of 4 is 24 alright guys this is how you uh, write factorial program using for loop uh, so recursion I'll be making another video uh, if you like this video guys please give it a thumbs up and until next time I'll see you guys in the next video until next time take care bye